Welcome to Agoracom, the small cap epicenter and Agoracom TV, a daily fast-paced edge show that brings you the best press releases out of the small cap world every morning at the open so you can hopefully profit from them and maybe even find your next great small cap investment. Now, it's Wednesday, January the 2nd. First, on behalf of everyone here at Agoracom and Agoracom TV, want to wish all of you a very happy new year and a great 2008. Got three press releases for you. It is a slow news cycle week for obvious reasons. It's going to be a short week in the markets, but we do have three great press releases for you. So let's start you off first with South Gobi Energy trades on the TSX Venture out of the stock symbol SGQ. They're esta- they announced that they established up to about 150 meters true thickness of high quality underground coal. Uh, this from their project in southern Mongolia. Highlights include hole number 80C intercepted about 148.9 meters, estimated true thickness of high quality coal. Uh, 89C, 111.9 meters, call that 112 of true thickness high quality coal. And finally, 82C, 66.5 meters, estimated true thickness of high quality coal. The cup is trading right now at $9. It's just off its 52 week high of $9.80. Next up, Gemtech also trades on the TSX Venture under the stock symbol JTC. They announced their first quarter numbers. I like these numbers a lot. These are for the quarter ended October 31st, 2007. Revenues increased by 6% to $742,000 for the quarter. Net earnings increased by 49%, love that number, to just over $193,000 or $0.08 cents per share. And finally, increased liquidity, the company's cash and cash equivalents, increased to just under $3 million as of October 31st, 2007. So, increase in revenues, increasing profits, and increasing cash flow, balance sheet, health, uh, uh, health. That's a great sign out of the company. What do they do? They do they, 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 this is a repeat performance for the company. They're a leading provider of community offender monitoring solutions to Canadian corrections. So, in short, they help track, uh, they, they help track uh, uh, inmates that come out of, uh, out of prison and I guess track them as they go through society with, uh, with all those tracking devices. They're trading at $1.27. Finally, Midway Gold also trades on the venture on the stock symbol MDW. News out of there isn't great, but I liked when I took a closer, uh, a closer look. First of all, they're approved for listing on the American Stock Exchange, so nothing earth-shattering, but I did take a closer look. And by the way, that is going to begin as of January 3rd. I did want to take a look at what warranted the move to the Amex, and I liked when I read this. This past year, Bear Gold Corporation has participated in equity placements of the company of over $10 million. So when Bear Company, uh, when Bear Gold in this past year puts over $10 million into a company, you want to take a closer look at the company. Uh, they're, uh, they're funding one of the more aggressive drill programs in Nevada. I like that as well. Uh, reduced geopolitical risk. The company controls over 60 miles of mineral rights along four of the major gold trends in seven project areas in Nevada. like that a lot. They're trading in the high $3 range. That's a wrap for the day. As always, if you want more great small cap companies, don't hesitate to take a look at the Agoracom Marketplace. We've got over 80 companies now by industry and exchange, so you can find the ones best suited for your portfolio. We'll see you tomorrow again. We'll probably be another slow news day, but as always, we're more focused on quality over quantity. Until then, have a fantastic day. See you then.